folks welcome to another episode of building with fusion today we are building another crm but this time we are going to use page templates for building our crm instead of building it from scratch so fusion has recently launched a page templates directory where you will find templates for easily building your saas app pages and this gives you a very good starting point where you get the basic skeleton of the page right off the bat and then you just need to tweak the details a little bit to get it to working as per your liking and that makes this whole process at least 2 to 3 times faster so that's what we'll do in today's video we'll show you how you can develop a saas app like a crm in a simpler and quicker way using these page templates so without further ado let's get started let's start by creating a new app i'll name it something simple you could tweak the theme colors if you want to give it a little bit of a personal touch but i'll keep it to the default and move ahead Now let's add some structure to the CRM by creating some pages. First, I'll create a lead details page. We'll use this page to display customer information. So I'm not going to show this page in the menu. Next, we'll create a products page. This is where all the products will be listed. So basically, this is like a product directory page. I'm going to display this in the menu. And next, we'll create a product details page. So basically, whenever you click on any product from the product directory, you want the user to go to a details page. where he can see the product details and the images so we'll use this page for that next i'll create a deal tracking page this one is important we'll use this page to display all the deals and the leads who are currently in your on our sales pipeline i'll add this page to the menu now that we have created some blank pages let's start adding some content to them one by one let's start with the products page so This is where we are going to display all the products and manage all the products and I found this neat template in the templates directory called the product directory. So this should be the perfect template for us to set up the products page. So I'll import it and start making some changes. So first I'll change the text product ID to HSN code. So these kind of small changes will help us customize the CRM exactly as per our needs. Next I want to keep the product categories easy to manage. So I'll change the uh, category field type to a drop down. And in the drop down options I'll add things like mobile phone, television, laptop, desktop, headphones. So these will become our product categories selection drop down. Next let's also turn the brand field to a drop down and we'll add options like Apple, Samsung, LG, Vivo. So these are the brands to select from. one final change to the label positioning and this page looks good now so next i'll make a quick edit to the product details page i'll rename the product id text to hsn code to keep things consistent between the directory and the product details pages now we need to link the products in the products table to the product details page so whenever you click on a product it should take you to the product details page With the product section configured, let's move on to the leads directory. We'll start by building this page with a template. This template gives us a good structure for managing and listing the leads. But additionally, I also want to connect each lead to a product because each customer will have requirement for one or more products and we want to display these products against those leads. We'll do that by creating a custom data block and importing the list of all the products to be further used on this page and next we'll use this list of products to turn the product field to a drop down so that whenever we create a new lead you can select which product they need from a list of products 
Let's also change INR as the currency for the product values. The status field is a drop down. I'll make some minor changes to the drop down options before we move on. And finally, I want the user to go to the lead details page whenever a new lead is created. Now that everything is set up, let's try to test it on the live page. Let's add some sample data to test it in action. Everything seems to be properly connected and flowing in proper order. Finally, I will spend some time on the deal tracking page. Let's use the Kanban template to set up this page. I'll make some minor tweaks before saving the page and then we test everything on the live page. And just like that, our CRM is up and running and that's it. We have successfully built a CRM system using page templates without writing a single line of code. And it just took us a few minutes. Now truthfully, we've built a very, very simple CRM here. But even if you're looking to build a more complex and a fully customized CRM, it should not take you more than 30, 40 minutes if you build it using these page templates. If you have any questions, drop them in the comments. Please give us a thumbs up if you like the video and don't forget to hit the subscribe button before you leave. We'll keep bringing more such videos to you every week. Thanks for watching and have a good day.